DRX is carefully designed to make the vulnerability remediation process fast and lightweight, so it won't slow down your network or your team's success. I'll walk you through how we go from discovery, to prioritization, to remediation. By the end, you'll have reduced your risk and your migraine. The dashboard is populated with real-time data from your on-prem, work-from-home, and cloud environments. This information updates as more assets are added or removed from your network. Applications are sorted based on their risk level, which is calculated using contextual exploitation properties. With VRX, you can reduce the risk in your environment in under two minutes. Let's start the timer. Ready, set, go. Let's explore our high-risk apps. There's a patch available for .NET Core and the vendor severity is high. So this seems important. Let's update. Select the date, time, and reboot settings. Pretty easy, right? But if you notice this asset is high risk, so there has to be more to the story. Let's investigate. So we still have some more updates. Let's take care of that in a more efficient way with some automation. Select .NET Core and click Update. Create as auto action. Okay, our app is selected. Click Next. Let's update by vendor severity. Select the reboot settings. Click Next. Okay, our asset is selected. Click Next. Select the date, frequency and time. Click Continue. Okay, everything looks good. Let's activate it. Excellent. So that takes care of our update now and in the future for .NET Core. Let's go back to the asset and explore what's going on with the other applications. Aha! So we see there are more high-risk applications, .NET Core that we saw earlier, JDK, and Firefox. VRX found binary-level vulnerabilities, but unfortunately, there is no patch available. No need to sound the alarms, though. All we have to do is apply patchless protection. So we see VRX has analyzed the asset. Let's check the box and apply the protection. Done. How are we doing on time? Great. Okay, I reduced your risk and made good on my promise. But I'd be remiss not to show you the dedicated vulnerability management section. Not gonna lie, it's my favorite. You can do so many things. The first thing you'll notice is the historical CVE trends. For example, we can see the ratio of CVEs that were mitigated versus detected over a 30-day period. You can also track vulnerability mitigation. Let's select a specific asset and we can see it took 26 days for mitigation. Now we'll navigate through the Active CVEs tab. Here we get real-time vulnerability data. We can apply filters for the OS and even search for specific CVEs. Let's filter the critical CVEs. The drop-down menu shows more information about the CVE. Clicking here takes you to the research community. We can pinpoint the affected assets and even find out more specific information, such as app risk and available updates. VRX's vulnerability management features have been shown to increase the lifespan of CISOs and CIS admins by 10 years. Stop scanning and start taking action today with a free trial.